I'm Ann Milner, and I'm a senator in the Utah State Senate. I serve Senate District 18. Saving really is the key to mental uh, and physical health. That is going to sound really strange. But if you have peace of mind that you're able to sustain you and your families through good times and bad times, you're going to feel better about each and every day. And even when a day is tough, you're going to know that somewhere you have the resources to be able to get you into the future. I'm the child of depression era parents. Saving was first and foremost in our family. The first thing you did was put money aside for the future. You put it aside for unexpected emergencies. You put it aside for retirement. You put it aside for education, um, for the things that you wanted um, to make sure that you had a plan for and that you could finance. So saving was first, and then you lift off the rest. And you know what? It worked. Um, my parents uh, came from very humble backgrounds, um, but they were able, because they put a plan in place that said, saving comes first, live off the rest. They were able to build over time a really comfortable life for all of us and support my education for which I am very grateful today and give me a foundation for the future. But even more important, they taught me how to save. Sit down and think about as a family, what you're going to need, what you're gonna to need to get you through an emergency, what you're going to need for retirement, what you're going to need for other things that are important to you to be able to fund. And then kind of decide how much you really need for that. And then in some way, put that money back on a monthly basis. And then plan the rest of your budget around what's left. We think about our physical health. We think more about these days, our mental health. Think about your financial health and plan for your physical health, your mental health, and your long-term financial health. <laughs>